Gravity Falls episode six. I like to get my Christmas shopping done early. Do you have anything that's in the spirit of the season? We're hungry. Hungry. Yeah, sure. As soon as this Yahoo makes up his mind. Do you have this in another animal? I'm fine locking him inside if you are. Panther <laughs> shirt. Honestly, fair enough. Panther shirt. I can't stand people like that. Reese's a diner. We have food. Eat. Shit! <laughs> Where were you yesterday? I got hit by a bus. <laughs> Hilarious. I believe Thank her. You. you do split plates, right? Maybe. Wink. Great. Well, I'll Dude. split a one fourth of the number seven, plus a free salad dressing for the lady, and a small plate of ketchup for the boy. He doesn't want. Stan, <laughs> not want to spend pancakes. money. With the fancy flour they use these days? <laughs> what am I, made of money? Yes, you are. You're a crook. <laughs> Test for manliness. Don't worry, guys. Pancakes are on me. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. I feel just a What's little so bit bad. Oh, no offense, Dipper, but you're not exactly manly You're, man you're a 12. <laughs> You were listening to girly Icelandic pop sensation Baba? Hey, all right, hold on. <laughs> it's not important. Look, <laughs> come on, guys, I'm plenty masculine. You see this chest hair? <laughs> God, it's too, too white. Oh, man. Quit stalling. Oh, and Wendy's friends are there, too. I just noticed that guy. The, yeah, right there in the red shirt. It went all the way up to man for a minute, and oh, then it went what? all the way down. <laughs> this thing must be broken. It's totally broken. Guys. It's like <laughs> yeah. a million years old. Probably ran out of steam power. Or... This is the manliest it's man I man. You yep. shouldn't even. Pinky. <laughs> yeah. You no. and her. Stop it. Ah! Oh, boy. You have a thing for Lazy Susan. <laughs> Want to take off our uniforms and run around in circles? Quit reading my mind. <laughs> I was... I didn't need to see that. Oh, I'm sorry. I was looking for the mailman. Oh, what? Are you saying I'm not a mailman? Oh is that what you're trying to say? I'm not male? Oh, man, is that... Is oh that my gosh, that? man. <laughs> <laughs> the thing is, I... What's so stupid is there's actually people like that. It's like, oh, what? So you don't think I'm, like, a man now? Like, it's... Uh, uh, uh. Was this a minotaur? Wait, sorry. Ah. <coughs> what is it? Oh. He's like a Viking. He has the male tattoo. <laughs> Are you some kind of minotaur? Yeah, exactly. Minotaur. That's what I thought. Half man, Let's go. Half, uh, half tour. So did I like awesome. summon you or The smell of jerky summoned me. Jerky. Mm. Hey, you know, you, you seem pretty manly. Maybe you could give me some pointers? Yes! Yes! I'm getting like a Luke Skywalker training moment. Dude, watch out! Silhouette shot. Jeez, man. Oh, it's like a dude bro place. This, this place is amazing. Eh, I don't know about that. I mean, a man cave is cool, but this is uh, a little too much bro for me, personally. Testosterone. But hanging out with the boys is always a vibe. Okay, Uncle Stan, welcome to the first day of whatever is left of your life. First, a before picture. Feels bad. Let's start out with some role playing. Zeus will play Lazy Susan. I'm sorry. They look miserable. Grunkle Stan, show me how you approach a woman. Remember, this is a safe, non judgmental environment. <laughs> Can I borrow some money? <laughs> this is going to be harder than you thought. Okay, fine. That's okay with me. Obviously, you guys think it would be too hard to train me. Maybe. You're not man enough to try. <laughs> 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 we have decided to help you become a man. 
Great. Thanks, guys. Whatever it is, I will not let you down. What is it down there? All right. Let's try to get that inner beauty on the outside. Dude! Sup, Ambone? What do you think? <laughs> oh, Horrifying. It's going to take some really great training music. Montage time? Montage time. It's like com like a yin and yang right here. Just complete opposites. <laughs> I love this. I like how literal the music is. You're on the... Don't, you idiot. Who wants to rub this on my back? Guys, I just want to say that these last few hours have been... I, I feel like there's really been some growth. One final task remains. I've survived oh, yeah? 49 other trials. Whatever it is, bring it on! It's the final trial, though. It's, it's probably... Oh, I thought that was a goblet. Is this a cult? Is he like the oldest or wisest? Or Definitely the wisest. Young. <laughs> nah, he's just the offering. That is leader R. <laughs> that makes more sense. Go to highest mountain. What is he doing? Is he ripping his heart out? And bring back head of the multi bear. <sighs> is this yours? Uh, no, <laughs> I, I don't know whose that is. It's just borrowing it. It's friends, not mine. Oh boy, I can't wait to see how this turns out. It's like going on as a journey, an, an adventure. Like we already had, we had a training montage. Now we ha we're having a, an adventure montage. You started like this, but you became. This is Can worse. I myself now? Uncle Stan, come with me and leave your pants at home. With pleasure. <laughs> What is a multi-bear? Multiple bears fused together. That makes sense, actually. Wow. Oh, that's a multi-bear. You have to slay this beast. Child, why have you come here? Multi-bear, I seek your head. Or one of them, anyway. There's like, what, six? Six heads? <laughs> Can I just take one? Leave now. <laughs> Pretty impressive. No way. A real man. That's impressive. No mercy. <sighs> Very well, warrior. But will you grant a magical beast one last request? Uh, okay. I wish to die listening to my favorite song. <laughs> you listen to Icelandic pop group Baba? I, I love Baba. It's Abba. I thought I was the only one. All the Manators make fun of me because See? I know all the See, you can be a man and girl. still listen to oh, epic music like Abba. Girl, this is definitely just Dancing through. Queen. That girl is you. A spin-off of Dancing Queen anyway. It's a spoof. <laughs> yeah, literally. <laughs> oh, like, come on, crazy. man. Finally, someone who, who understands that. Being a man oh, yeah. by stereotype is the I lamest thing ever because you can't do anything you, fun. I'll never be a man. I accept my fate. No. You keep telling me that being a man means doing all these tasks and being aggro all the time, but I'm starting to think that stuff's malarkey. Kill the multi bear or never be a man. And I guess I'll never be a man. Boo-week! Lazy Susan, listen, I know he's not much to look at, but you're always fixing stuff in the diner. And if you like fixing stuff, nothing could use more fixing than my Grunkle Stan. Also, women live longer than men, so your dating pool is smaller and you should really lower your standards. So, Lazy Susan, <laughs> what do you say? True, well, you can't really. <sighs> hey, here's my number. Why don't you give me a call sometime? Hey. Yes, we did it. Let's go, Wait, baby. You want to call now? I don't have a phone. Let's buy a phone. We can put it on a credit card. Let's get a credit card. Mabel, let a man enjoy his buy, huh? Zipper, it's me, Mabel. I'm looking at you through the glass. Right here. This is my voice. I'm talking to you from inside. Uh, hi, uh, hi, 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 Mabel. Did you see me through the... Yes. What's wrong? <laughs> I don't want to talk about it. Good. 
It's just these half man, half bull humanoids were hanging out with me. Here we go. But yep. then they wanted me I don't to want to talk this about really it, but tough, let me explain thing, it. But it just wasn't right. So I said no. You were your own man and you stood up for yourself. Yeah, like yeah, you did what literally. was right even though no one agreed with you. Sounds pretty manly to me, but what do I know? Being a Wait man a is minute. very subjective, I suppose. Me? You have a chest hair. What? <gasps> a singular what? chest hair. Let's I go. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, that's disgusting. Yeah, no one asked for that. Now you just rip your shirt. Oh, not again. Off of Message number 36. Hey, handsome. It's me, Lazy Susan, calling to say hi. Hi. My cat also wanted to say hi. Say hi, Donald. Good, Sandy. You yeah, I think hi. you made a mistake. That, oh, gosh, she sounds crazy. I get out of this you know what that's uh actually that's fair that is like why would is my thing going oh okay by the way people told me there was stuff in the credits i don't know if it was these credits or if it was the credits uh, Message number back here hey, handsome. It's me, lady. i don't know i'll have to search for it but people told me there were hidden messages usually they said usually they're jokes um but uh, sometimes it, it gives implications into the war uh, hidden in the credits. I don't know. I'll have, to, I'll have to look into that. But that was a very fun episode. Um, very interesting. You know, Dipper being the manly man. I, I, I don't like that stereotype at all. I, I think it sucks, to be honest. Like being a stereo, stereo... I can't even talk. Stereotypical man is boring, in my opinion, because you can't do anything fun. But, you know, being a man is very subjective, you know, based on how you perceive it, of course. Um, but, you know, Abba Dancing Queen, I mean, that's a great song, you know. You got to have a little bit of disco in your life here and there. And that's a great disco song. So, um, but yeah, that was a very fun episode. I really liked it. And, uh, yeah, I, I... You know, I find it really funny that the Minotaurs talk about what it means to be a man, even though they're not men because they're Minotaurs, which means they're not human. But that was just a little, 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 little fun nitpick I found. But other than that, I, I mean, the episode overall was really fun. Uh, had a fun premise. You kind of feel bad for Dipper, but you know, he just do the right thing by the end. And Grunkle uh, Stan clearly here does not have great luck with the. Uh, women and the one person he finally gets that Mabel actually talks him into getting sounds like a crazy cat lady so that's always fun anyways I'm blabbering on um on to the next episode